Ignore the fact that he just lied. <laughs> Abby, I got you guys something. You want to see? Happy Valentine's Day! About failing as a mother and how I feel right now. It's like trying to do your best as a mother. <laughs> So we're out here letting Callie go potty. Hey, Shepard. <laughs> Calvin. Well, Calvin's more interested in his ball, as you can see. Calvin. <laughs> so it's not it's not like freezing out here, but it is cold. It's like, Calvin, is it 37 degrees? I don't know. I honestly don't know. I'm guessing it's like 37 maybe. Oh, and it's Valentine's Day. <laughs> As you guys may may or may not know, we are not Valentine's Day people. We don't we do not really celebrate Valentine's Day. And we never know what day it is on and we never do anything for Valentine's Day. But like I I don't really care. It's not like anything we ever do. I don't care. I don't know if anyone else cares. I mean, if I was in school, maybe I'd care a little bit more because I know they at schools they do things for Valentine's Day, but obviously I'm not in school. They had a Valentine's Day dance at our school that um, I was actually allowed to go to, but I decided not to go to because I'm not a party person. I don't like going to parties or dances. I mean, it was more a party than a dance because you play just dance, which is not really a dance. And, I mean, I guess it is. And then you dig, um, decorate cookies. So, yeah, okay, not my thing, but okay. <laughs> You like jumping? <laughs> He's having fun. You like jumping on the tram? Every single time we use Alexa, Shepard immediately grabs his stool and comes up here. What are you doing? <laughs> and he plays with water. It's very, very interesting. Pay like attention. Look into this lens. Not at our beautiful. Not at my beautifulness. <laughs> <laughs> don't look at you, you're ugly. Look at your look at the beautifulness of me. No, don't do that either. Just look at the screen. So, me and Kaya get to go to an etiquette dinner tonight. Now, we're both invited, and I think mom RSVP to it. Um anyway. I don't know what you're doing. Yeah, I know you know. Anyway, um I don't really want to go. I mean, I kind of want to go. But I'm, too, I'm too fancy for it, anyways. I I would be way. I'm too cool for those things. <laughs> Are you guys hiding? <laughs> for some reason, their favorite game is monster. You pretend to be a monster. They run around the house laughing and screaming to death. And screaming to death. No, just kidding. Try to have two. I'm not Shepard's not here? No. Okay, thank you. I'm gonna go look for Shepard. Ignore the fact that he just lied. <laughs> He's just playing. Normally he doesn't say Shepard's not here, so it was very interesting. But yeah. They're so adorable. And they got dressed. I had a, I got them dressed. I mean, there's a little bit of a fight getting them dressed. But they they did it. And mom's apparently bringing home a treat. We're gonna see what it is. Because it's Valentine's Day! You guys, I we don't really care about Valentine's Day, but it is if you guys care about it. Oh yeah, I just walked in the door and I just I decided to grab the kids a little Valentine's treat because it's been a while since they've had any kind of treats, treat treats. So we're gonna give them one. Abby, I got you guys something. You wanna see what kind of treat I got you? This one's for Abby. Yeah. <gasps> Isn't that cute? Yeah. This one's for Shiloh. This one's for Ezra. Happy Valentine's Day, Ezra. <laughs> this one's for Shepard. He's over there. This one's for Kai Kai. Cool guy Kai. Happy Valentine's Day. Oh, did I forget about you, Hanny? No, just kidding. It's got a puppy on it. It's got a puppy on it. Oh. <laughs> It looks like I know. Do you know, Ezra, do you know what's inside of there? I Ezra, what do you think's in there? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. You don't know? What do you What do you think's inside of there, Ebby? You gonna open it and see? Did you hear Ebby? Oh. 
Valentine's Day chocolate. What is that? How many did it come with? Three. Happy Valentine's Day. That. You want a little treat? <gasps> what is it? Yeah. What is it? <laughs> Can you say treat? Um, who wants this? Yeah. Put it out. Yeah. Happy what? Valentine's Day, baby. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> hey guys. So I just wanted to talk to you a minute, kind of about failing as a mother and how I feel right now. Um, you know, the thing is, is I, I kind of haven't wanted to talk about this because I am a very positive person, but I know a lot of moms out there really, really struggle with feeling inadequate in certain areas. And I think a big part of that is when you are pregnant and you have other kids, whether you have one kid or whether you have six kids. And for me, being pregnant is, it's difficult, it's hard. Um, I, I honestly, I have a lot of problems in pregnancy, not, not serious medical problems. I mean like physically, mentally, I get drained. Um, and I, but I try to stay really positive. Like that's the thing is, I don't ever wanna talk negative about being pregnant. I, I, I view pregnancy as a huge blessing. And I will go through any pain and any kind of discomfort that I need to because I cherish the life that is inside of me. It just, it, that still doesn't make it easy and mentally and physically. And so when you're having those, those issues, it's like trying to do your best as a mother, trying to do all the things you want to do, taking your kids to parks, um, organizing things, doing parties, doing, you know, your daily activities with them, just bending over to give them a bath is sometimes a struggle, right? <laughs> so that can be a really difficult thing. And I, I'm trying to stay positive. I don't want to feel like I'm failing, but there are those moments when I feel, and I know a lot of people out there feel like you're just failing as a mom because there's all these things that aren't going perfect for you and I'm pregnant and I can't do this and I can't do that and I'm tired. So I just wanna encourage you guys out there um, to just try to stay positive and have a positive outlook. Um, and what I do with my kids when I start feeling like this is I try to just have fun and I try to do things that are exciting and just stay positive so that they don't know that I'm struggling because they don't need to know that I'm struggling, right? Um, they just need to know that they're happy, safe, um, loved, and all those kinds of things. So whenever I start feeling like I am feeling as a mother, this is what I like to do. <laughs> also, they have no idea that I'm about to do this and it's gonna be hilarious. I don't know why I like doing this, but it's funny. And most of the time, the little kids love it. <laughs> they think it's funny, but Hanny doesn't like it. She doesn't like it. <laughs> Hi guys, so if you don't hear, mom is sewing upstairs and I was sewing and I made this collar. Now, I was kind of lazy actually and I didn't want to like take a bunch of time to make a really nice collar because <laughs> it's called laziness. Um, so I just made a really simple collar. It's not even that good actually. Um, but anyway, I'm going to go try it on Calvin. Here's the collar on Calvzy boy. Look how good it is. I can't see very well. Look how good it is on him. It looks so nice. Um, it's just for fashion, which is why I didn't take a whole lot of time on it. But it looks so good on him, doesn't it, boy? Oh, this is what our baby girl's gonna look like. Except it doesn't have <laughs> drawings all over his head. I know. So I just made this cute little dress. Is that like not the cutest thing ever? And we're just trying it on him. I feel like doll. I should. I feel like I should rock him. I know. It's so. <laughs> it's gonna be so cute. Then. 
And this is a finished product. So cute. She's going to be so adorable in this. I can't wait to see her in it. So I've been sitting here sewing while Shepard took a nap. And he actually took a nap today. Yesterday he completely 100% refused to take a nap. So I'm really grateful he took one today. Um, so, but I hear him waking up. So we're going to go downstairs and do something else now. But I got this outfit finished. So I'm really happy about that. What are you guys doing? I, uh, I need to find a more diamond in pocket. My <gasps> dad diamond. You found a diamond? You got it right there in your pocket? I love it. What are you going to do with that diamond? Mm, watch. I'm going to watch this. Uh, you <laughs> you can and see me. i dad in middle. You're so cute. Yes. <gasps> That's cool. I'll put it in the eye. It's special. Do, do that to my eye? Yeah. What do you think? Oh, because you can see all kinds of things. Yeah. It shows like a lot of people. Yeah. <gasps> Hello, Shepard. I'm just coming to say hi to you. Dad, dad, dad. Really? Is it cold outside or warm? Warm! He's like, I'm back out. You going back out there? Uh, yeah? I'm oh, oh you leaving me? Bye! Oh, he is so cute. I can't wait for summer. Ebenezer and Shepard, I mean, all the kids love being outside. Like, what kid doesn't want to be outside? But Shepard, he's constantly, all he wants to do is go outside, but I think he's so tired of the cold weather that like now when it's really cold he doesn't want to be outside very long so today it's 52 degrees right now which is is like really warm for what we've been having and he is having a blast it just gets me excited for spring and summer like don't you guys feel happy and excited when the sun comes out and it like shines through your house like i always get motivated that's when i get like the most like I want to do stuff like I can I want to clean I have motivation and I want to go out and play with the kids I want to take them to the park so I, oh, I can't wait I'm really looking forward to that <gasps> look at you big boy he loves it Jason moved the trampoline out here and he he, he just loves it like he's such a bouncer boy it's not high off the ground don't worry it's like one of those really short ones I'm you a good boy Say hi. hi. Did you have a good day today? Yeah. Yeah. Can you, Abby? Can you tell me what your favorite part about today was? Going um, outside. What was it? Going outside. Going. Can you say outside? Outside. That's right. Going outside. Going treehouse. Did you go to the treehouse? Yeah. You did. Oh. Me out it down and up. Yeah. In a room, me found this. You found that? Oh, I bet that was one of your favorite parts. You found that. Huh? Yeah, Dinner. I was really rude. You were rude? Yes, me asking about our shirt. Oh, you accidentally hurt Ezra? Yeah, yeah. yeah and me go to mommy room. And you had to sit in mommy's room. And uh, me did talk. Yeah, and were you sorry about hurting Ezra? Yeah. Yeah, you were. And I shut down in the room. He said Ezra's in the room because Ezra was hurting you too. And huh? alone. And he's alone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I should get down. Yeah. All right, here. You want to say goodnight to everybody? Good night, everybody. See you next time. See you next time. Say, go live the epic life. Mm, epic life. <laughs> Oh, okay guys, good night you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Yes, go live the epic life and inspire someone with your story. I am exhausted tonight. I am definitely ready to go eat some dinner and put these kids to bed so I can get some rest. <laughs> Alright guys, we'll see you next time. Bye!